Okay, right, morning gentlemen. We received a telegram from General Lee. We've got to put in an attack to the Federal line. They're six miles north of our position here. Okay. Right. Um, he wants this put through. He, we, if I should take the Federal line, we must hold. Hold that line. He says to us, good luck. I think General Lee's going to need it because we're short on the ground. Okay. He says that he will be sending in five divisions to support us. But at the moment, he's 10 miles away. We've got, I think it's three hours to put in this attack. The federal line is here, up here. I've marked out all the maps to show you where the appropriate divisions are. There's a federal line there. Okay. Colonel Ellerslie, you will take your division and you will reinforce General Pickett. Colonel Mosby, you will take yours and you will reinforce Colonel, uh, General Stewart, who is six miles east of our present location. He is there waiting for you. Once you get to him, you pass on and he's got to move east of the Federal line. You have a map of the area. Take my map very shortly, mark up the area. You'll come round through the ravine by these hills here. Follow the river along. There's a road there. Okay. Try and split your division to come in from round behind. Okay, if that is possible. Okay. Artillery. Yes, sir. At 12 of the clock. I want you on Alpha Hill, Alpha Hill, sorry, let's get this right, Alpha Hill, which is three miles from the federal line. On top of that hill there, take all the artillery with you. At 12 of the clock, you will open fire on the federal line. You will continue firing for one hour. By then, Pickett and Stuart should be in position. At one of the hour, Pickett and Stuart will attack the federal line. You should be by then no more than two miles away. Get within 500 yards of the federal line, then place the attack. You'll pass that to General Pickett when you get there. Lieutenant, yes, take your two companies. You will come to the base of Arthur Hill where the artillery are, okay, you will then reinforce General Pickett with the two companies. I will follow down with the remainder of the division I have in camp, all my cripples who can, who can, who can walk and carry arms, we will come down and reinforce. So it's going to take me a bit of time to get to you, because I've got a great camp to get down to you. Right. The other divisions which are there is Pegum. I've got Stonewall Jackson, he's up, up front. He's doing the observation. I don't know how true that the, this, this is, this situation is, but we must take that federal line. We take that federal line, it puts us within reach of Washington. If we can take Washington, we've won the war. Right, any questions? Yes, yes sir. Go. Do we know what the ground's like round, round this the area? The ground here is pretty rough going. Roughly. It's pretty rough going. Get your, the, past the Stuart, that I want these, the cavalry in position no later than 12 o'clock. So you've got a hard ride ahead of you. Once you're in that position, okay, then take take it from there. Whether Stuart wants you in one cluster, one complete group, to attack the line, or whether he wants to split them. But your orders will come from General Stuart.
Perfect. If you down. think that is advisable to split the group, then split it. Okay. Enough men, enough men I've got there, we can probably split the group and come tack them one side and tack the other side, let know where they come from. Okay. If Stuart thought agrees with that, do it. Okay. Jerry Leslie, any any comments on that? No. No. Do you I reckon you could? Do you reckon you can get your division there? Uh, here on our force march at the most yes, sir. and it will be a force march to get them down there to general cricket I'll get them there you'll get them there ok you a force march again get your companies down to the bottom half of the hill you you will leave as soon as this briefing is finished get your guns everything ready and move out right, because that is going to be a very hard rough ride to get your guns on top of that hill because at dead on 12 of the clock, I want all your guns to open up on the federal line. I don't want any of these federal troops out. I don't want them escaping and letting the, the, the rear know what's going on. I don't want any federal troops left alive if you can help it. I want that, I want that line. Okay, any more questions? Ammunition. We've got plenty of ammunition in, in, st in store at the moment. As I said, we've got reinforcements coming up behind, replanted. You should have enough to carry on with this attack. I know you were hard at it yesterday with your attacks and everything else, and you were running short of ammunition, but I've got enough here to replan the men and get them out. You should have enough uh, cannibals and powder. Okay. Have you got air bursts? Um, You're short of air bursts. Yep. Use as many as you can. Okay, that air burst will give us an advantage. It will give us an advantage. Okay, any questions, gentlemen? No, sir. Right, no, get your divisions, companies ready to move out. You have one hour to get everything ready and move. Would you, as quick as you can, get your guns ready and move? Yep. Okay, gentlemen, thank you very no, much. No.